Come on, ducks. Do you want to know how to invest in your 20s? Maybe later? The pigeons do. Jump, what the fuck? <laughs> You know, I want to talk to my millennials out there, to all my young people, because if you're in your 30s or 40s or 50s, you know that you can invest at any point in time. But I get this question all the time, should I invest in my 20s? How do I invest in my 20s? So I want to talk to my millennials. Here's the reality. Right now, you're at a unique time in your life. You guys are dominating right now. You're taking over, us old people know it. Without a shadow of a doubt, give you two or three years, you're gonna be literally taking over the game. And everybody else is gonna be riding your coattails trying to keep up with you because of a couple things. One, you millennials, you guys have access to information unlike any other time in human history. You guys have specialized knowledge right at your fingertips through YouTube and podcasts and all this amazing information. The old way of doing things, having to go to college and get a degree and maybe a master's degree, getting a corporate job, working your way up the corporate ladder, that shit's prehistoric nowadays. That is not a requirement for success. In fact, if you ask me, that's probably a hindrance to your success. It's a waste of time and a waste of money unless you're going to be a professional like a doctor or an attorney or something like that. You don't need college. You have everything that you need right at your fingertips, right in front of you right now. You also have amazing mentors in your life that are willing to take you on and show you things you can't learn in books. You also have an amazing amount of youthful energy. I didn't really understand what that meant until I turned 40 this year. I'm starting to move a little slower, react a little slower. I'm watching you guys and I'm I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I'm jealous, I'm envious. I see your attitudes, I see your energy levels. And I'm like, yes, that's what it's gonna take to dominate in 2019 and beyond. You guys, listen, think about this concept. We all know that you should invest, right? There's only a couple paths to creating wealth. Invest your way to wealth, you can build a business and sell a business, right? And become an entrepreneur and entrepreneur your way to wealth, or you can inherit your way to wealth, right? But you can't save your way to wealth. Money gets devalued over time, it's worthless. That's why things like Bitcoin and crypto are you know, sexy and cool. And the truth of the matter is, our government is in a massive amount of debt right now and it's, we're never gonna get out of it. It's impossible. So you can't save your way to wealth but you can't invest your way to wealth. So when I get asked the question, should I invest in my 20s and how do I do it? My response is this, the earlier the better. Think about this, Warren Buffett, one of the richest men in the world, started investing when he was 11. He became a millionaire in his 30s. He didn't become a billionaire to his 50s. If he would have started really hammering it earlier, right, even though he made that early investment, he really didn't start fully applying it and reinvesting his money until he was in his 20s. If he would have started a few years earlier, really hitting it hard, he would have been a billionaire way faster. Here's just some stats. Let me just let me just show you the, the bell curve for Warren Buffett. I, I wrote some things down. I just, age 26, he was worth 150,000. Millionaire in his 30s, by the time he turned 48, he was worth 100 million. 1985, he had a billion. 1989, just four years later, worth 3.6 billion. A few years later, in 1995, worth 10.7 billion. 2001, 32.3 billion. 2008, hit 62 billion. Today, he's worth over 86 billion dollars. What does he know that the rest of us should know? Well, one, he knows that you have to invest your way to wealth. Number two, he understands the power of compounding. You ever heard that concept before? Compounding is where you take your money, you invest it into an asset that produces more money, then you reinvest the profits that you made 
back into it again to make even more money. So it's your money making money making money and it starts snowballing. And there's two things you need for compounding to work. One, you need an asset that produces profits and two, you need time. The more time, the better. And I am jealous of the millennials out there because not only do they have this powerful technology and they know how to use it, they have specialized knowledge and they know how to use it, but they also have this massive drive and ambition to get out there and prove to their parents, prove to the world that they have what it takes to build wealth. Time is on their side and they don't have a family. They don't have massive bills. They don't have a mortgage. But they have the opportunity right now to put everything on the line and take on a lot of risk while they can before it becomes too painful to take on that risk. Now is the time is what I'm saying while you're young. Now when people ask me, Cody, what should I invest in? I obviously lean towards real estate. I know that more millionaires have been more made through real estate than any other industry out there. I don't care if you want to invest in stocks, that's what you're passionate about. You want to start a business, that's what you're passionate about. You want to do Bitcoin or gold, that's what you're passionate about. Eventually, all roads will lead back to real estate because it's real. Everybody needs a house, everybody needs a place to stay. It doesn't matter what happens in the economy or who the president is. It doesn't matter what happens with the advancements in technology. Even if they make flying cars, those cars will be parked in garages. And you can create a massive amount of wealth in a very short amount of time by putting your money in real estate. It's one of the most proven assets out there. <clears throat> and the reason I like real estate is because with stocks or gold or crypto or starting a business, a lot of times it takes money to get those things up and going. You can use other people's money, but a lot of times it takes money. With real estate, I could teach you four proven ways right now that you can get started today investing in real estate, massive, making massive amounts of profits very quickly, using little to no money out of your pocket. Now, I don't want to get into those strategies right now. I have other videos here on YouTube about that and lots of training I provide. But you can't invest in stocks with no money or Bitcoin with no money or uh, you know gold with no money, but you can invest in real estate with no money. And it's a wealth accelerator. Once you are making money from other channels and you park it in real estate, you can accelerate your wealth very, very quickly. So should you invest in your 20s? Absolutely. I've taught so many amazing young people how to build wealth in real estate. Austin Zayback, you guys probably know him. You've seen him on my channel. You might follow him on other social platforms. Uh, he came to me as a student. He was very, very young. I think he was 19 years old. I taught him how to invest in real estate. Uh, taught him the creative investing way. I taught him the traditional way. He went out there and freaking dominated. He became one of my most successful students. Eventually became one of my partners in my business. We did a lot of deals together. He eventually bought my Lamborghini. You might see it rolling around town uh, with Austin driving it with a huge smile on his face. The guy's absolutely killing it. Josiah Grimes taught him the business. He came to me when he was 17 years old. Uh, last month he flipped 80 deals. Let that digest for a second. More deals than I've ever done in a single month. He dominated. Hunter, uh, uh, you might have seen his testimonial on one of my uh, on my website or one of my channels, holding a huge stack of money. This guy's absolutely killing it, uh, closing deal after deal. Guy's super successful now. Logan out of Florida. I mean, I got tons of these stories, guys. And the reason they're dominating right now is they're taking their youthful energy, they're channeling it into dominating real estate. They realize that they can use real estate to create massive amounts of wealth in a very short amount of time. And now they're stock investing and investing in crypto and investing in gold and starting other businesses. And they're out there proving to their parents, to themselves and to the world that they have what it takes. And they're ready to take the torch from us old guys and run with it, make their lives mag magnificent. And it's awesome to see. It's unbelievable to see, and I'm just so grateful to be a part of it because I'm feeding off your guys' youthful energy. I love it. 
So thank you. If you're a millennial and you're watching this right now, drop me a comment down below with your thoughts on what you think uh, that you learned in this video. Just a quick recap. How do you build wealth? You invest your way to wealth or you start a business and you build your way to wealth. What's a wealth accelerant? Real estate. What's another one? Compounding. Mastering the art of using compounding to reinvest your earnings, to create more earnings and absolutely explode your wealth. Because ultimately, the ultimate goal isn't just to gamify the creation of money. Because I could teach you that and it's fun to uh, know how to create money at a whim. But it's really what the money could do for you that makes the biggest difference. There's no greater feeling in the world knowing and having the pride that you did it. You put your mind to something, you sacrificed everything, you worked your ass off, you worked smart, and you dominated and you crushed it and you made a lot of money because of it, and now you have ultimate time freedom. You get to do what you want, when you want, with whom you want, because I'm telling you right now, being young is a beautiful thing. You're very lucky to have this time in your life. So drop me a comment down below with what you learned about in this video. Like the video, smash that like button, share it with your friends. I don't have anything else for you. I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm Cody Sperber, The Clever Investor, signing off for now. Till then, take care, comb your hair, Sperber out. Hey listen, while you're here, right after you subscribe to my channel, go ahead and grab my free book, How to Flip Houses with Little No Money Down by clicking the link down below in the description. It's my gift to you and it's a step-by-step -step guide on how I got started in real estate and how you can too. Hope it helps.